So I became a huge fan of Regina King as an actor from the TV show The Leftovers, which I thought was brilliant by the way, and you should definitely check it out. As was the TV adaptation of Watchmen, which she also starred in. So in recent years I've become more familiar with her work in front of the camera. But this time she steps behind the camera to direct an adaptation of a stage play. A play that takes place over the course of one night and is apparently a fictionalized account of an actual night. Probably because outside of those people who were actually there at that point in time, no one really knows what happened, but it's sort of a meeting of minds. It's about one night when Malcolm X, Muhammad Ali, Jim Brown and Sam Cooke get together. In the mid-60s, during a very turbulent time when race issues were heavily in the forefront of culture. Which rings a bell for some reason, I'm not sure why though. Anyway, those four basically black influencers of the time come together and talk. And they talk about what's going on in the country and what roles they each play in that. And how they might influence the people and culture and what sort of responsibility they bear. And you know, I thought it was a well-made movie that kept things interesting. It's essentially just two hours of people sitting around talking, but it never bored me. The pacing felt good and the movie in general didn't feel like it dragged. And for the most part the performances were really good as well, as they needed to be. But I feel like Kingsley Ben Adir as Malcolm X kinda stole the show here. He pretty much outclassed the rest of them and made them seem less impressive in comparison. And I gotta say I'm looking forward to seeing what he does next too. Because I don't recall ever seeing him in anything before, certainly not in a major role. But this performance definitely put him on my radar and I'm gonna keep an eye out for his next project. Other than that though, I really don't have much to say about this one. It's interesting and well made and kept me entertained throughout. But I'm just not sure what exactly I'm supposed to take away from this. That celebrities and people in the limelight and in the forefront of popular culture have influence? That they have the power to change things and influence the way people think and how culture evolves? And that as entertainers and whatnot, those people do have some responsibility to use that power for good? Well, that seems to be one of the major points uh, it was trying to make. But I just feel like that's a pretty obvious point and not exactly anything mind-blowing. At the same time, I always do feel a bit weird about these sort of movies too. Where you take real actual people and then just put words in their mouths. When you don't have really any way of knowing what actually happened that night. Or who said what. Not that that's a big issue, but it for sure doesn't really help a movie like this. So you know, at the end of the day I enjoyed this and it was very solid all around. But I don't feel like it left much of an impression on me beyond that. So I'm feeling like I'm gonna have to give this one a high 6. Boop. Because it is still pretty good. However, would I recommend it? Eh, why not? Maybe give it a shot or, you know, don't. After all, I'm not your dad. But hey, what are your thoughts on this? Have you seen it? Did you like it? Let me know. And if you enjoyed the video, maybe give it a thumbs up or sub to the channel because that would be fantastic.